the best, best, best thing of this entire apartment is this. The view. This view. What's up everyone, this is David Hoffman from David's Spin here in beautiful Kolkata, West Bengal, India. Today I'm gonna give you my apartment tour. We're staying at a super sick two bedroom apartment. It's very charming and it's here in the Lake Garden area which is like the southern part of the city. Very quiet neighborhood, I love it. Lots of people walking around. And yeah, let me show you the unit, follow me. So this is the building and we're on the last floor, fourth floor. And the way it works is that we got four keys. We have two keys for these gates, right? So. In this neighborhood, everybody has a lock on their gate, right? And oh, it's already open. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, sorry about that. Okay, so here we go. There's a car park here. If you do have a car and you come in a car, which most of you won't because you just fly in. And then there's no elevator. So when you come in your bags, pack lightly. <laughs> and we're on the fourth floor, right? Yeah. One flight of stairs and I'm already tired. Oh my god, you work out. Oh, I'm legit tired. So this place has the ultimate security system. The door's locked, the gate's locked, and then we have a gate on the door with a huge lock right here. And here we have it, our two bedroom apartment. All right, so the first thing you have to do, Close this door with the top latch. We have a living room with a colorful couch, as you can see. Nice little table. Oh, hold on a sec. <laughs> it's been a long day. Oh my god. The rarest thing, us actually relaxing on a, on a couch. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. This is probably the first this time I sit down in a while. And uh, yeah, so here, first thing you see is a beautiful, spacious office, lots of light. Natural light. We have all the lights off, so everything you're gonna see is with natural light. We have a little desk, got some space, actually, it's locked. Here it's open, so you wanna put some stuff in here. I have my laptop, my hard drive that I always travel with. And here they have like some, like, uh, I don't know, just like a bangle type of painting right here. And then over here we have a little bookshelf and our old school boombox. 1980s, right there. <laughs> That's amazing, huh? The cool thing about this place is that it really feels like you're stepping back in time a little bit. Probably dates back to the 70s and 80s. They, they haven't updated it too much. The one thing they did update was the bathroom, which I'll show you later. Right here we have the fridge, right? And this is the first time on the entire trip that an Airbnb host actually stocks the fridge at least with something. Got some eggs, bananas. Here we have like some tangerines. We got some honey. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and. Uh, Crackers in case you're starving, right? Because when we're hungry and we have nothing, we have to go look for something. And that sucks. I like it when they hook me up. Right here, we have a little dining area. Three seaters, utensils, water, fresh water, right? And then here we have all the cups. You got coffee mugs, beer cups, regular cups. We have right here plates, bowls, salad bowls. And then here, well, we, we just arrived, so I haven't actually put this in the bathroom yet, but this, here's our towels, fresh towels, right? Napkins, I mean, this place is great. And then here, we have the kitchen. Look at this. It's like a yellow orange theme. Oh my God, <laughs> Jeff, look at that. There's, there's a little stuff there. They should probably remove that. But uh, yeah, it's a little orange, white, yellow theme. I mean, this is like a more old school kitchen, but it has yeah. everything you need. It's a fully equipped kitchen. Here we have, Fresh water. Oh, that's the best, man. Right there, perfect. Here you have coffee and you have tea. We have a little toaster oven. We have a toaster. We have this to make coffee. We also have this. This is something really cool. This is actually what we have in Miami to make Cuban coffee. A little cafe cafetera, I think it's what it's called, cafetera. And then, yeah, I mean, here, if you want to turn this on, this is what you do. Just, right, turn it on. And then, Turn it off, <laughs> didn't work for me. He showed me earlier, but I didn't get it. And now let's go to the second bedroom. Sam's bedroom. Oh, nice, fan's still running. Leave it on, please, it's off. <laughs> Here we have two twin beds, okay? Little table in between, nice big closet. 
And over here, we have a standard Indian bathroom, but this one, I like it because they actually separated the bathtub a little bit, like the shower, okay? The shower is with a little, see this, this is like a four inch divider, and then you take a shower, you close the curtain, and you don't soak the entire bathroom. This is amazing, because this is like a real Western bathroom. Toilet, toilet paper, very Ooh, essential. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Faucet, and then here we have the heater. Now for the heater, and then here we have the button to turn on the heater. No, that's the light. It's light, it's light. Yeah, but it's yeah. somewhere here, because I know where mine is. Yeah. So let's go to my room now. So at least you'll get a hot shower. I mean, we can share it, right? <laughs> Thanks. And here we have a nice mirror. It's not a full length mirror, but I mean, it does the job. I can see my entire body from here, shoes, all over my head. Great, this is perfect for women. I know you guys want to see yourselves in the mirror before you go out. My wife loves to do that, and we don't have this. <laughs> I'm done. Next, master bedroom. First thing we have here to the left is the bathroom. As you can see, it's like some white marble. Very nice. Same thing. There's a shower that is divided. There's a four-inch little, uh, you know, elevation here. You have the curtain right here, right? And you have the heater. And now this one, I know where it is, right here. There. Ready? <laughs> see this here? Watch. Watch, watch for it. There you go. It turns red. Great toilet. Faucet. I mean, they really updated this bathroom. This is the one I can really see a difference from like the 1970s feel. Whew, wow. I need to turn on all the fans and the air conditioner right now. I know. It's, hot. it's so hot. We have a little put in here to separate in case you want to separate. And here's my room. The master bedroom, right? Closet. Got hangers if you want to hang some clothes. You can put your socks, underwear, you know, shoes, whatever you want to do. And there's also extra blankets and pillows down there. Have a little table here. I just threw some stuff on there that I need to look at later. And here we have a queen size bed. Feels a little hard, but I like that. My back needs something a little sturdy. Ah. And then the best, the best, best, best thing of this entire apartment is this. The view. This view. I'm surprised we still have bars up here, but <laughs> but I actually like it because it's like looking through the bars, you can see the city. I mean, you can see basically the entire area from here. We're, we're looking over most of the buildings. I mean, obviously not everything, but I mean, it, it gives you a nice, you know, uh, perspective of what the neighborhood looks like from the skyline. And right now, come here, come here, come here. And you can see the sun setting all the way up there. I love this place. The host is great. He brought us here. He like told us exactly how to get here with Uber. We picked the point got here, walked in, he took everything upstairs for us, he helped us, because if not, I would break my back walking up all the stairs with a huge luggage from Victorinox. Victorinox is too big. <laughs> Sorry, that's my sponsor, I always gotta give him a shout out because they support me always. And yeah, I love this place, we really haven't seen Kakara yet. It, we've arrived like, what, like six, seven hours ago, so tomorrow and the next three days, we're gonna really explore the city. There's a lot of things to do here, a lot of food here, Chinese food as well, because there's a huge Chinese population here. And yeah, I'm super excited and I hope you guys love this video and I hope you want to come to Kokoda and stay in this place. And if you love this video, give it a thumbs up, leave me a comment below, subscribe to my channel and Same. my channel. And we'll catch you in the next travel adventure in India. Incredible India!